Hi, I'm Devin Latchley here with Camille Champagne. Also here with senior football players Carnell Jones and Jakai Sharp. Okay, question for Carnell. How does it feel to be first game back with your hurt ankle? Uh, it's a scary process to say the least, but still we're going out all summer. Just got to get right back into it. Good. Now a question for Jakai. I'm here with Jakai Sharp. And how does it feel to be QB1, three-year starter? I mean, I feel good, you know. I get to control my offense, go out there, throw passes, run the ball, and just have fun. How's the dynamic duo of being a wide receiver and a QB1? Oh, we don't go. Oh. All night. Look, all night. Hey, a connection, a connection that kind of got kind of rocky when I went down, but we getting back to it. Back together. That's all that counts. <laughs> and I got to think my big old line, Scotty B, right here. Ah! Ah! This is the trio that many people don't see since middle school, but it's back now. Yeah. Hi, my name is Camille Champagne, and I'm here with Devin Latchley and head coach Marcus Lewis. <laughs> and I wanted to ask you, how are you feeling after the, today's game about this upcoming season? Um, I was real, real confident on how our guys played. Um, you know, we had a lot of learning lessons in the game. You know, offense moved the ball well. Then they had some penalties. Defense gave up some big plays, but then we made some big stops. But overall, I mean, I thought that they played well. We uh, focused on just getting better for the next week and getting better for the season. Sounds good. Okay. Going back to preseason, how do you feel that Coach Kevin Francis helped us with this upcoming season? Oh, absolutely, man. Coach Francis is very integral to our whole uh, program. I mean, not just for football, but for the whole Gator uh, Nation as far as athletics, man. Um, you know, a lot of people bought into everything he was saying. You know, kids are getting better, getting stronger, getting faster, uh, and they basically just becoming better athletes. And so for that, you know, he's very, very important to our program and success. What does the defense and offense need to do this season to be successful? Well, I mean, in order for the offense to do well, they just got to score, you know, you know, move the ball, control the tempo. And for defense, you know, just got to make uh, big stops, you know, uh, keep the offense off uh, from scoring touchdowns. And special teams, of course, you know, just got to be special and make big plays. Okay. How do you feel the team's chemistry? How do you feel about it? Like, is it there? Is it good? Oh, I think the chemistry is uh, real good. It's always been um, the upperclassmen always uh, look over for the younger guys. The younger guys look up to the upperclassmen. I mean, the chemistry is always there. And we always focus on, you know, a brotherhood when playing football and uh, even just being a Bochan Gator. Coach, is there anything that you think they can improve on after seeing today's game? Oh, absolutely. Um, there's always something to improve on, you know, uh, whether it's blocking, tackling, uh, catching the football, um, running the football. I mean, it's every facet of the game can be improved, you know, as just long as they're uh, working towards that progress. Thank you, Coach.